don't forget to subscribe before watching my video. Thank you. Today's protagonist Mina is annoyed by her boyfriend who hasn't been in touch for several days. She visits her best friend Jin Kyung and tells her of her troubles. And Jin Kyung comforted her as usual. But Minna was still in pain at the thought that her boyfriend was cheating on her. Eventually, she decides to go to her boyfriend's house. But no one was nothing in there. Meanwhile, Jin Kyung was preparing a special meal for making good mood Mina. And that night, they have a hot conversation on the bed. In fact, they were bisexual who liked women as well. And a man was watching this figure. After a while, she gets a call from an unfamiliar number. Wait here, Sung Jack is her ex-boyfriend's name. Minna was somehow drawn to the appearance of a man similar to her ex-boyfriend. Sonsey in this way, they developed into drinking alcohol in the relationship between a teacher and a disciple. But when you look at me, I always think of the song. I'm eating, I'm eating. They end up getting drunk and go to the motel. At the same time, Jin Kyung is extremely anxious because of can't contacted Mina. A few hours later, Mina returned home, and suddenly she slaps her on the cheek. Mina 
이젠 절대 안 그래. 약속할게. 알았어. 나도 미안해. Next morning, Minna can't remember what happened at the drinking last night. 아무리 생각해도 기억이 안 나. 어제 윤재 씨랑 술을 먹고 대화를 하다가 일어나 보니까 혼자 모텔에 있었단 말이지. 근데 또 홀딱 벗고 있었잖아. 아. At that moment, someone has come to her house. 안녕하세요. 며칠 만에 많이 늘었네요. 이 정도면 웬만한 곡들 소화하겠어요. 자꾸 나 빤히 쳐다보다 많이 쳐. 눈도 못 마주치고. 그러면 제가 불편하잖아요. 자꾸 그날 밤이 신경 쓰여서요. 아, 사람 무한하게 너무 기억을 못 하시네. 그렇게 신경 쓰이면 무슨 일 있었는지 가르쳐 줄까요? 가르쳐 줄게요. 우리가 뭘 했는지. And the next day. 신고한다 그랬나? 해 신고. 그럼 난 이걸로 뭘할수 있지? The man started threatening her with a covert video. 그러니까 신고하려면 해. 아니면 내가 시키는 대로 조용히 맞춰 주든지. She had no choice but to comply with the man's request. From this point on, Mina started to become extremely sensitive. <웃음> 아, 미나야. 미안한데. 나 피곤해. 오늘은 그냥 자자. 아, 미나가 왜 저러지? At that instant, a message arrives on Mina's cell phone. 내일 7시에 집 앞으로 나와. 가능하면 알지? And the next day, this man receives a mysterious phone call. 저 미나 친구인데요. 대신 제가 보면 안 될까요? 문자로 주소랑 시간 보낼게요. 네, 그럼 저녁에 보겠습니다. And he mumbles something incomprehensible. 드디어 걸렸다. 형. It was the same for the woman who mumbled strange words. 이걸 또 꺼낼 줄은 몰랐는데. What the hell is she trying to do him? 어? 앉으세요. 근데 저는 무슨 일로 오시자고 하시는 거죠? 아. 누나 대신 내가 하고 싶어서. 아, 진짜 궁금했었는데. <웃음> 이렇게 주였나? 박성재. And the truth of the case is revealed. <웃음> 이 친구가 왜 나한테 넘어오는 줄 알아? 박성재랑 닮은 얼굴 그리고 냄새까지. 네가 그게 없음 박성재가 내 형이야. 쌍둥이 형. At the same time, Minna realized that Jin Kyung had gone to meet the man on her behalf. <gasps> Jin Kyung, you are how do And she sees a shocking scene there. Jin Kyung, you are now what are you doing? She is my sister's friend. She is trying to get me to get a divorce. What kind of joke is this? 아니. This movie ends with only these three minute scenes left. 숙소시켰다 먹자. 너이 곡이 좋아했잖아. In this way, what will happen to them now? Next time I will introduce another interesting movie. Thank you. 설마. 나 잘했지. 뽀뽀해주면 안 돼?